crack. You know? <laughs> that's why, actually, that's good though. We came out here sooner than later. Okay, <laughs> all right. May I ask you, to, 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 today will be rain or no rain? Well, it doesn't matter. It's about to rain missiles. It's a light chance Ice. of showers. Huh? There's a chance of showers. Yeah. Wait, right? the Lord will hold back the rain. The Lord will stop the rain. It's all right. It's a shower. What time? Around 8.39 o'clock. Look. Then you better to do some preaching, man. No, we're going to preach, all right? We preach non-stop. Every day, not every day. But every day, I'll be on the internet every day. You go to the library? You know you get free internet in the library. What, were you cast out of China? Yeah. <laughs> How come you came to America? What? How come you came here? How what come made you I came here? Yeah, I'm sorry, I you won't mean, tell you. Alright, but we just we have make teaching videos on YouTube so people can learn. For me, I came here, it's not I choosing to come here. Not me to choosing to come here. Oh you didn't when choose to come here? Fifteen years old, can you choose to be I don't uh, want to come here? Not if your parents make you come here. Thank you. Yeah, I bet you got it. You miss, uh, so you miss your home? Where you, where you like it better, America? Where are you from, China? I'm not from China. Where are you from? I don't know. Where are you? Tibet. Where's that? Where are you from? Hell. 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 Say, call me, really, where are you from? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, see, that's China. Well, British. That's actually part of the British Empire, ain't it? No, 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 no. Yeah, come on. The Queen of England controls Hong Kong. No, it's not. The yes, China it is controlling. Yeah, right. They think that. 1997, they already well, controlled the so-called. You know, the Queen of England, she's in, she controls the whole earth. You know, she's the earth. Well, actually, it's the bankers behind her, but whatever. Yeah. Okay, you go ahead to preach it, okay? I'm not bothered. Oh, yeah. So we talking about Hong Kong. Yeah, because Hong Kong, that place is filthy, though, man. That's worse than New York, ain't it? That's a big, nasty city. Big buildings and smoke everywhere and pollution and thieves and robbers. Prostitute. Prostitute. <laughs> drug dealers. It ain't no better than New York. Name it. You, you, you got it. Yeah, Hong Kong is famous. You get anything in Hong Kong. It's good. It's expensive. I bet. But it's no good. A lot of rich people like that place. Yeah, I got a scripture for all the rich men that like to go, like uh, your boy Kim.com. When he got in trouble with the law, he fled to Hong Kong. <coughs> Who is Kim.com? Remember Kim.com? No. Uh, he's a big famous internet guy. Oh, well, a lot of people flee to Hong Kong. A lot, a lot of big, big shots, hot shots. A lot, you know? lot of a big, big money. Big, big church is going to Hong Kong too. Oh yeah, I bet. A lot of money to scam people. A lot of most preachers are, uh, are liars and scam artists. You know, uh, they like to deceive people and take all their money. I want to say something to you. Don't look at all the eggs. In one basket is dead. Oh, I know. It's not all the pieces are dead. Oh, I know. I'm sure there's some. Okay. Some, I'm sure there's a few of them that's okay. I'm not saying it's everything. Not all of them. I'm just, for the most part, I'm just saying they know they can make a lot of money. Just like is all the church, the member, is that they go to heaven? No. Oh, they of course are not. not. We pray. You do not come from the revelation. Huh? It's, it's about it's one third to following with the king of the king. That's the right. The one third. The one third. Then to go to, go to the hell. To the two the thirds go hey, to hell. Right. Well, one third is getting the same, two thirds getting destroyed. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> he said oh, he hopes so. Don't worry, don't worry. 
They, they will happen. Hey, I'll get it for you. I got one for you. I'll sit here to listen to you. Okay. I'll just preach. I'll just preach. <laughs> That's my dude right there. He said one third, only one third gonna make it. And that's true, <laughs> that's in the Bible. I'm about to read it. Oh yeah, you see over there in China, you got a lot of Chinese people, uh, Israelites over there in China getting uh, into the Bible, reading the Bible. And the government's starting to crack down on them. Uh, what's that about to get? Yeah, because the communist government, they don't want to have people out there teaching the Bible. That's that's a threat against their power. You know what I'm saying? We get Revelate, uh, excuse me, this is Zachariah. Man, I can't even see straight today. Okay. I'm not used to, uh, I got it. Zechariah 13. Hold up. Okay. Zechariah 13 and 8. And it shall come to pass that in all the land, it's talking about America. And that shall come to pass that in all the land, save the Lord, two parts therein shall cut off and die, but the third shall be left therein. Let me read that again. And that shall come to pass that in all the land, saith the Lord, two parts or two thirds, therein shall be cut off and die, but the third shall be left therein. That means the one third is going to make it in two. This is talking about Israel. Two thirds of Israel is going to be destroyed. And only one third is going to make it. Said they shall, oh, excuse me, I'm messing up. Uh, Zechariah 13 and 9. And I will bring the third part through the fire and will refine them as silver is refined and will try them as gold is tried. They shall call on my name. And what's the Lord's name? The Lord's name is Yahweh and the son's name is Yahweh Shah. The Lord's name is not Jesus, okay? He said, uh, I will bring the third part through the fire and will refine them as silver is refined and will try them as gold is tried. They shall call on my name and I will hear them. I will say it is my people, the people on this sign, and they shall say the Lord is my God. Because the Lord's coming to save Israel. The people who believe in the month. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? So, uh, all right, I think we had a question, you know what I'm saying? This is how Oh, we just we're teaching Israel, you know what I'm saying? You ever heard them about the nation of Israel? But, I mean, the truth is getting out. We got brothers teaching everywhere, so the truth is getting out there. We just out here to wake up Israel, you know what I'm saying? We out here to teach the law, statutes, and commandments. You know, tell our people to come back to the Most High, stop being a fool, stop being engaging in wickedness, adultery, you know what I'm saying? Because most men out here, they just about foolishness, playing video games all day. They ain't about no kind of knowledge. They ain't not informed. They don't watch the news. You know what I'm saying? Here is the devil, huh? Right, because here the devil's bringing the sword down on us. He's fucking us up daily. And they, they busy playing goddamn magic. You know what I'm saying? I'm going Well, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I'm like that. I'm, it's cool to play games and shit. I used to do that shit too. Sometimes I was still too. But what I'm saying though is it's time to get serious. You know what I'm saying? We come in some serious times. I know you've been watching, you watch the news, you see what's going down with Russia, the United States. I mean, this third world war could pop up at any moment. They got, the, the, the Russians, they got, they just tested the ICBM, the Intercontinental Ballistic Missile. They rolling out the nukes now, they about to invade Ukraine. So what's your, what's your opinion? Uh, you believe in the Bible, bro. 100%. It's crazy because me and my cousin was just talking about well, what it is, I'll break it down for you. 
the way the churches are, okay, you got a lot of people going to the church. They, they, they in, in their heart, they probably believe in the Most High, but they're ignorant. They don't, they don't know nothing. And they don't know that the churches was all set up by the devil. Okay, the so-called Illuminati, I'm sure you heard about Illuminati. They, they set all these churches up, okay? Starting with the Catholic Church, the Roman Catholic Church. So all, all these churches out here are pretty much Roman Catholicism. They all teach that uh, Virgin uh, Mary was a virgin. That's not in the scriptures. They all teach that you got to go. Not in the scriptures? No, nah, it's not in the scriptures. It's in, it's in the Bible. I could break it down. Just give me more. I'll just go over some things real quick. They teach that Mary's a virgin. But that goes back to some ancient pagan beliefs. They teach that uh, you got to go to church on Sunday, which is the worship in the, the sun. That's why it's called Sunday. Monday is the moon day. Okay. Because you know all the days of the week are pagan. You got Sunday, uh, Monday, the moon day. Tuesday is named after Tyr, a Norse god. Wednesday is Odin's day, or Woden's day. It's Odin. It's Thor's father. Thursday is Thor's day. After Thor. And Saturday. Some people believe that Thor is really a god, right? Well, uh, he probably was based on a real person, probably an Israelite. You know what I mean? The Israelites. And we are really descendants of Israel. Right. Like, even the Norse Vikings, they, they followed pagan ways. But even them, uh, they go back to Israel, okay? Don't you know you have black Vikings? Did you know that? You ever hear of, uh, I ain't got no internet or nothing, but you should Google, you got the internet or what access? But remember this, okay? Get on Wikipedia and Google King Edward III, okay? He's a Norman king, king of England. To make a long story short, the Vikings, invaded England back in 1066, okay? They was called Normans, but they were Vikings. And they conquered England, and a lot of the kings in England descend from Vikings. Now, if you look up a picture of King Edward III, you will see these are black men with woolly hair, dark skin. Same thing with Jesus. Right, he was Vikings, right. But they, but they got Jesus looking like Johnny Depp. <laughs> no, that's true, it's funny though. Jesus, this is skin of bronze, and he got wool. Yeah, woolly hair. Even King, you got pictures of, you can look up pictures of King James from the King James Bible. And his pictures of him, you can clearly see he's a black man. The bottom line is, I mean, you can't be from the Middle East, you know Your color, your color. Right. You know what I'm saying? Just the law of the sun won't allow it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. But, uh, no, I'm really not, no, man. I like to hear, I don't knock nobody's beliefs. Like I said, I'm a real Christian, but. I got some, I've been in a penitentiary. Well, here you go, I got something for you. What is the, uh, the, what does the word Christian mean? Because these people have tainted the word the Christian. Word of, the word, word Christian means that you're followers of Christ. Right, but the actual meaning, because right means followers of Christ. Because Christ means uh, oil, to anoint with, it literally means to anoint with oil. Okay, it's a Greek word, Christos. That's where you get words like, uh, what's that, uh, Crisco, the Greece? Crisco. Crisco the, that's, that goes back to the Greek word, Christ, Christo. Okay? And actually, because the Hebrew word for Christ, because Christ, it is not Hebrew. Christ is uh, Greek for the Hebrew word, uh, Mashiach, or as we say in English, Messiah. Because Messiah also means to anoint with oil. Okay? So, so, Of course. You believe Jesus uh, died in the cross? Of course, 100%. I got a scripture for you today. See, that's something the Muslims deny. They deny that you. Uh, well, they don't deny Jesus. Right, but they, they deny. Believe, they believe that Muhammad was the last prophet. Right. When this, I got something to cut that too. Not knocking it. Like I said, I don't knock nobody for their beliefs. Right. I just know what I believe and what I've seen that Christ and God has done in my family. I feel you. You know what I'm saying? It's my whole thing is we, I, the scriptures are, we got to contend for the truth. You know what I'm saying? Our job is to, is to tear down the law. You know what I'm saying? And, and we're, we're supposed, if somebody's out here teaching uh, garbage, see the scripture says, mark them to cause division. All right? That means we got to mark them. We got to let everybody know, look, this dude's teaching lies. Like I said, we got Muslims walking around teaching that Muhammad madness, but we gotta, we gotta call him out, you know what I'm saying? We gotta prove that that's not the truth. Cause that's how we edify our brother. Like the word uh, edify means to build. The only way we can give brothers faith that we, is to prove to them that everything else is a lie. Okay, we, that's, we gotta do that. That builds faith, you know what I'm saying? But let me get this.
What was that? What was he talking about? Oh, I had a script in those, but I forgot all that. Oh, you forgot all that, though. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know that. I mean, I believe that. Yeah, I was just going to get some real quick. Uh, Romans 8 and 9. It says that if thou shalt confess with thy mouth that the Lord Jesus... That's another thing. Uh, like, when, when you read the Bible in Hebrew, and you, you, when you find out the Lord's name in Hebrew, you'll find out there's no J's in Hebrew. Yeah, I just heard that. Oh, yeah. 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 So, yeah. Right, because he got a... That's American. He got a billion names. The Muslims call him Isa. Uh, the, the Mexicans call him Jesus. Uh, the Greeks call him Ice, like Jesus, however you say it. We call him Jesus. Let's see, America is a big thing for as far as black people. Not just some of somebody else. It ain't like white people came to Africa and just took us. Some probably did in some parts, but the kings and queens of Africa sold us and traded us. Well, you what it that? was, what it was, is not like the Africans, a lot of those Africans ain't your people. What happened, you got Hamites in Africa. Who knew that other black people were not their people? They knew that they were Israelites. We had Israelites living in Africa, going back in the ancient world, up in Carthage, northern Africa, west, all up on the north, mostly in northern Africa and the west coast. And all kind of Israelite nations have been there for uh, thousands of years. You know what I'm saying? Like chosen people, right? Yeah. We descend from Israel, right? Yeah, exactly. You notice, even I don't know, I never like Bush. They protect Israel. Well, actually, I think that's the Lord that makes them do that. You know, like they give them food stamps. Uh, you know, shit like that. You know, that's that's. I got scriptures for that too. But really, at the same time, they're helping you. But then again, at the same time, they're killing you. Like they, they set up these forced abortion, not forced abortion, all these Planned Parenthood uh, abortion clinics. You know, they're making us murder our children. Turn that bullshit down. You know, too, also at the same time, though, a lot of people don't know, like I was saying, King James was black. If he was black, what is that? Too? A lot of the Irish and Scottish that came over here, too, they came over here, they was black. You know what I'm saying? That's why you got it today, like a lot of Irish white dudes. They live in the hood, right along with black in the same spot. And the, uh, that's you know where the word redneck come from. The word redneck come from the uh, the black slaves making fun of the white slaves. You know what I'm saying? Because they have both fun of the white slaves or making fun the, of the, the white master. No, the white slaves. Because you have the Irish. Uh, most of the Irish came over here as slaves. You know what I'm saying? Back in the early days. But look, so I'm saying that the slave masters made. Like I said, a lot of Africans didn't know nothing about no English or nothing like that. Oh, okay. So they talk, you know, how in the Bible it says, oh, obey thy master and stuff like that. Oh, they, they, they twisted. They, exactly, man. They talk what they wanted to teach. But really, but the, the, the scripture condemned them. Because, hey, I got a scripture for you. And at the same time, they try to say, Jesus loves everybody. If Jesus loves everybody, why you put you in slavery? But at the same time, I mean, I'm not going to say Jesus, but I believe that at one time, God said, you guys don't follow my law, which, you know, it's been broken. You got the Mosaic law. You got, you know what I'm saying? Right, right, like that. At the same time, God, somebody else just told me that, that Jesus didn't love everybody. And that's true. And I believe because they said that, uh, you know, you guys, I'm going to put you guys in slavery if you guys don't follow my, my, my law. You know what I'm saying? Just like he did the flood and just like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's all. He said, I'll scatter you among the heathen. And that's what happened. So that's why I see the scriptures teach. Let me read it. Get, get you a scripture for you, man. Because this will get to what's really important. Hey, look. Let me a favor. Let me and her watch Chipotle. We got a timer on my thing. Let me put some change in here and come back and check. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead. You going to be here? Yeah, I'll be here for all a right. I'm going to come back and holler at right, you, man. Please. Hey, man. Knowledge is everything. I appreciate that's you, what's up? Hey, whatever it is you believe, you doing oh, I was about to tell you, uh, the Lord's name is Yahweh Shah. That's how you say that. Yahweh Shah. Like when you pray. It's like, because the most high's name is uh, Yahweh. Yahweh. Say Yahweh. It's not Yahweh. It's not Yahuwah. It's Yahweh. So when you pray to the most high, you got to pray to Yahweh in the name of Yahweh Shai. And that gives your prayer more power. You know what I'm saying? Do you, you ever heard that Jacob, Yaakov, was a, a scientist? <laughs> that's Nation of Islam. That's a fair kind of movie. Yeah, that's you don't a, believe that? Nah, that's, that's crazy. 
why, why couldn't he have been a scientist? Well, well, no, he was a scientist. Sci the word science is Latin. It means knowledge. So he was, but he wasn't a two-headed scientist. I didn't say, they said he was two-headed. Yeah, they say he had... <laughs> it's crazy. Man. They say he lived on some island. I, I know all that they stuff. They said what, about how he created white people? You never heard that? See, that white people can't. See, I know. Because I, I got the book. And, uh, uh, that's the teachings of Elijah Muhammad, I believe. And, uh, well, I don't say all of it is because... Uh, so you, you hit the 5%ers? Yeah, I'm, I'm aware of every group, bro. Every, I'm aware of everybody that's out there. You know what I'm saying? I, I study everything. That's how I know we have the truth. Oh, you know what I mean? As far as what's your, what's your religion? Or not religion. I'm an Israelite. That's it. Oh, we're a nation of people. It's not a religion. You know what I mean? We're a nation, that's bro. That's man-made. That's man-made, well, right? man-made. You're a straight Israelite, huh? This is an Israelite. I'm I out here doing the work, teaching, waking brothers up. You know what I'm saying? Okay. All right, bro. Much love, much respect. All right, if you don't come back, bro, you get house shot, bro. That's the most important thing. The scripture said, whoever calling the name shall be saved. Okay? Call that. So the name is very important. That's the main thing you should take away. Your house shot in Israel. That's why I tell people when they first get in that truth. There goes Charles Barkley. <laughs> hey, boss, y'all keep it up. All right, bro. Man, we about to get on. pissed on. Huh? We about to get pissed on. We got umbrellas. Yeah, them umbrellas ain't worth the fuck. They all made in goddamn China. As soon as a gust of wind hit it, it just collapses, falls. Don't even work. Why even buy a goddamn umbrella? If you want to get an umbrella, you better get one of the good ones. Made out of some fucking steel, titanium. But I was telling that dude, I was trying to always emphasize the name of the Lord. That's something you got to remember. You can't remember nothing. Remember that. Let me read that scripture then. Because uh, you got a lot of fools on YouTube. They'll say that you can call him any name you want. You know, it doesn't matter what you call God. The name's not important. The name is very important. How am I in the book of Joshua? Let me get back to... Romans. Romans was written to the Israelites living in Rome. If you believe in the Most High, you know you're you know you're an Israelite. Watch this. Romans nine. Excuse me. Bro, I told I, I read this earlier. I said it was Romans eight. I don't know what I was thinking. My brain is messed up. It's Romans ten. Romans ten and nine. That if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus, or Yahweh Shai in ancient Hebrew, thou shalt believe in thine heart that God had raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. So the scriptures say, whoever calls on the name, y'all don't know the name. Whoever calls on the name, what's up, bro? You know the scripture said, whoever calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved. What's the Lord's name? Oh, he go. fucking said it. Oh my god. Oh. No, sure he already hit. Right. He already know what's going on. I'm not sure. I like it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's good. That's so I just want to hear the word. That's Never heard, heard no way you just come up and say it. I mean, that's the spirit. I mean, that's why I told the last dude that came out here. That's how I told him, like, this word is getting out, bro. Right, I mean, because right. we got brothers everywhere teaching. I mean, it's like the people that know who we are now. It's like back in the day, they didn't know Israel. What the hell is Israel? Right. Now a lot of people know about Israel. Definitely. You know what I mean? Just, just, just want to hear the word. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't making no crap. Oh, that's cool. Right. Right. More people here, the, the better. Definitely. So I'm just saying. studying out of my, my book of my pocket. Oh, for real? Yeah. What, you be, uh, you watching videos on YouTube and stuff? Nah, uh, um, East Main, we got a uh, school. Oh, who you down with? Peraza. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, hold on. Now, you know, so you go there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I got in a big <laughs> argument with, with uh, it's really Pi Rise Up. I got, I got in a big, I mean, that was back a long time ago when I first looked up and I was kind of crazy. I, I'm, I got, I'm more, uh, what's the word? I'm more seasoned now. Right, right. I know how to handle myself better. When you start off, it's like, Right. Yo, I don't care. Yo, that's not what I just heard. So, yeah. But like, I'm in Paraza. I don't know. I got <laughs> some, some, we had some beef or whatever. Right. But, you know, 
I ain't, I really ain't got no I ain't got no no nothing against Peraza. I talk to him now, but you know what I mean. If we all straight in this word, if we all brothers in this word. So what? What if we got doctrinal fun. differences? Okay. Okay. That well, that was part of it, and there was some other stuff. I don't, you know what I mean? Like I, he was teaching people. Like we don't teach them. You're going to burn forever in hell. We don't teach that. Okay, because we teach it. Is he teaching that? I know. I don't, I don't, I'm just trying to figure oh, out. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm asking teaching. you. Does he still teach that? Burning forever. Yeah, because he got a video on YouTube saying I, I was at his class and he was telling people they were going to burn forever in hell. Who's going to burn forever? The wicked. The wicked one. Well, anybody. He, doing he was even saying, high. yeah, even Israel could burn forever. Mm. I, I mean, I was trying to talk to him. I haven't heard that yet, so... Oh, you haven't? He tries not to go into it. Oh, you bet. He got a video on YouTube teaching it. But he doesn't understand that fire is talking about America getting destroyed. Babylon, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll break it down for you. Because when you go back to eyes, I'll break it down like this. I'm going to go to Revelation. Uh, what's your nationality? We're trying to... I'm an Israelite. We're, we're trying to... I mean, ultimately, I don't exactly know what tribe I'm from. Okay. You know what I'm saying? To the spirit, I know I'm an Israelite. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So, to the scriptures. What's your father? Uh, what's your father? Is, he's an Israelite. What's his nationality? We don't know. We don't know where he comes from. Oh, really? We try to do, I mean, we have kind of a general idea, but we don't really know. Mm -hmm. I can only trace our line back, what, three generations? Yeah. I, I, I only know who my dad's grandfather is, and that's it. Okay. But we don't even know. You don't know his nationality either? Uh, I never even, nobody even, nobody even know where the hell he came from. <laughs> I used to think I was Irish. We're not a Edomite if that's what you're hinting at. There's no salvation. No salvation. For Esau. I believe there's uh nah, bro. In the description. I'll break it down for you. He, I understand. You know, you know Cornelius is, don't you? Cornelius, yeah. You know Cornel salvation, Cornelius is an Israelite. The most high said he was clean, yeah. You know, I wanna show you something. Let me show you something. I'll break it down for you. <coughs> First I'm gonna I'm gonna just go to the uh I'm going to go, I'm, this is what the Lord said in red letters. It's Matthew 15 and 24. But he answered and said, I am not sent but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. So he only came for the lost sheep. So Israel has been scattered among all nations. Okay, when you read in the book of Hosea, I'll get it real quick. What I'm saying is, how do, if, if salvation is not for Edomites, how do you know you're not a Edomite? Through I, faith. Well, you, you got faith. You know what I'm saying? No, you can't prove that you're an Israelite. Nobody can. My people are came here in captivity. Nobody. Well, I'm enemies. saying nobody can prove. You ain't, we all. We, nobody has records. We may have came over here on the same slave ship as you. Who knows? Well, but nobody has records. You know what I'm saying? You My know, family's from uh, Mississippi, though, so it has to be a tribe of Yasser. And that's what I'm saying. So you, your records have been stolen from you, but you have no records. So you're going on faith because you believe in the scriptures. You know the scriptures is true. So that, that so what, what's letting you know that you're an Israelite? Let me, what's letting me know? Yeah, what lets you know? A, the Bible. No, because my people was brought, I, my history starts with slavery. Right. Right, right. right. But where do you get, well, where, well what does that prove though? Because but the most high said they were going to The Israel most high said it. Where, where is it said at? In the Bible. In the Bible, right, right. right. So, so this is the only hit. So that's you, our hope. But our you faith. know that because that's a prophecy. And right. a prophecy is what? A spiritual saying. You right. got to be spiritual to, and have faith to even get it in the first place. I understand. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Everything is based on faith. Like, we, ain't nobody got records going all the way back to, to Israel 50,000 years ago. Nobody has that. And everything's on faith. You know what I'm saying? Israel has been scattered among all nations. You got Israelites living in every country on the face of the earth. This Chinese guy right here, he's an Israelite. He believes in the Most High. Everything's by the Spirit, bro. Just because you believe in the Most High make you an Israelite? Yeah, for the most you part. you really believe in your heart, you got to be an Israelite. And the scriptures say Esau is the devil. The devil don't believe in the Most The scripture said in Obadiah 18 that the entire nation of Edom is going to be destroyed. Okay, right, right, right. there shall be none remaining of the house of Esau. Created, created there shall be it. none remaining. So there's no such thing as a believing Edomite. That just that doesn't exist. Esau is the devil. Mm. 
He don't, it's not in his spirit to believe in the most high. Let me read something. This is Amos 9 and 9. For lo, I will command and I will sift the house of Israel among all nations. He said among all nations. Not just North America, not just South America. Okay, and North America, China, you get Bruce Lee is an Israelite. You know who Bruce Lee is, right? <laughs> Bruce Lee, you can't tell that spirit? Black people love watching Bruce Lee movies. Well, you see the, the rhythm he got, the way he moves, and look, he got the spirit of the most high up in him, bro. That makes him Israelite. You can, it's spiritual. You can tell through the spirit. So he, Buddha, Buddha, Buddhism, they have a lot well, of spiritual positive the, energy, so that means that A lot likes. of them is Jake. But the original Buddha, uh, Sid Hartha. He's an Israelite? He's an Israelite. He's a, he's a black man. Buddha statue's a statue of a black guy. You see what's that? He always keeps the commandments of the most high love. What? Israel is known to be wicked. The, right, right, the scripture right. said two thirds are going to be destroyed. Right. So that, that's Israel's mo is being a goddamn demon. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Israel's all about the, script, the Lord called us, uh, not us, but two thirds of wicked and adulterous generation. You know what I'm saying? That's why we put in the chapter. Right. Oh, look, that's the spirit because I'm reading this. Amos nine and nine. Now we read this. We talk about America, but this is this is actually talking about Israel. It says, uh, excuse me, Amos 9 and 8. Behold, the eyes of the Lord God are upon the sinful kingdom, and I will destroy it from the face of the earth. The most people in America are uh, Israelites, you know what I'm saying? You got, uh, you got black people, you got Irish. You know there's more Irish people than any other white people. The Irish and Germans probably. You know them so-called Jews, they're not the real Jews. I know you know that. Types. Right. But you got uh, Mexicans all over. You believe Mexicans are Israelites, huh? Yeah. Okay. But you got, well, no, you got some, but you got some people who say only black people are Israelites. No, no, no. And that's ridiculous. Hispanics and West Indians are Israelites too. Right. Right, Native American. Look, but uh, we go back. Amos 9 and 8. Behold, the eyes of the Lord God or upon his sinful kingdom, and I will destroy it from the face of the earth, saving that I will not utterly destroy the house of Jacob, save the Lord. So he ain't gonna completely destroy it. He gonna kill two thirds, and he's gonna save one third, just right, like right. Zachariah said. Right. But uh, then it goes, like I just read, it said Israel scattered among all nations. Let me get another scripture for you. I understand that we can't go off and walk with the city. Bro. Right, you gotta be spiritual. Everything's spiritual, bro. Exactly, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm not. I'm just trying to, you know what I'm saying? Cause I never seen um, red skin like a man teach. Uh, so I'm trying, I'm trying to teach that, teach the children of Israel that they're, they're, they're Israel. So I'm just trying to figure out. I'm just trying to hear from your right. perspective. Are right, you got a Bible? Read the scripture for me. Get Le Leviticus 13 and 13. Yeah, you know, a lot, a lot of Irish are Israelites, Irish, Scottish. You know, the, uh, Ireland used to be known as Hibernia, which goes back to Hebrew. Like I said, you got black Irish uh, today living down. They got videos on YouTube. Look up, get on YouTube and look up the black Irish. Oh yeah, I know it's black Irish, oh, and I yeah. know it's black uh, Russians too. Yeah, they black Russians, right. Mm -hmm. They're all over the place, bro. Right, right, right. I'm just, you know what I'm saying, trying to get This is what happens, this is right. what happens. I'll give you an example. Okay, say we got a black guy went and fought in the Vietnam War. Right. And he got a bunch of them whores pregnant. He's fucking on his whores over there. And what happened to those babies? They grow up uh, maybe half black, half Vietnamese, but then he has a kid and his son looks totally Vietnamese. You know what I'm right, right, right. And so, yeah, and he's gonna have kids and he's gonna have more, and by the time the years go by, he done had a hundred descendants right. who look Vietnamese, but are actually Israelites. Mm -hmm. so you gonna have, you gonna, right. definitely gonna have that because Jake was down in Vietnam having sex with all those whores. Right, right. Okay, I was in Thailand having sex with whores. And all of my friends were too. I know some of them had to get pregnant. You know what I'm saying? So it, the, just Israel seemed to be scattered among the whole earth. That, that's, what, that's what happened with Bruce Lee. So probably going, it could have been going back 2,000 years ago that, that uh, Israel might have sex with a mole bite. And after the years went by, he was completely Chinese now. You know what I'm saying? That, that's how it happened. Right. Well, 
Uh, uh, Leviticus 13. And this is another. Oh, it's already highlighted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, okay, but. <laughs> I said, I finally got it highlighted. Now, 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 before you read that, let me ask, what is the book of Leviticus? The law. It's the law. Who was the law given to? Moses and Aaron. In Israel. It, Israel. Yeah. Was, it, was it given to any other nation? No. It was not. No, no, no. So these laws right here are for Israelites. See, for the, the most high is the God of Israel. Right. It's like the Romans worship their men God. Exactly. He was our God. And his book got stolen from Augustus. He destroyed our literature. And then they, they spread it around. Right. Well, of course. From, but they, stole, they robbed the country. Right. Exactly. That was under Titus. Yeah. But, uh. Okay, so the that these laws are all pertaining to Israel. The, those leprosy laws right there, read that, Leviticus 13. Leviticus 13 and 13. This is not talking about Esau. Then the priest shall consider, and behold, if the leprosy has been covered all his flesh, it, he uh, shall... Over all, all whose flesh? Over all his flesh. Over his like, an Israelite. He shall pronounce him clean that hath the plague. It is all turned white. He is clean. Oh, yeah. And notice that he is clean. So we know that it's not talking about an actual, because you got many forms of leprosy. leprosy yeah, it's spotted. You got, uh, like Michael Jackson got. You yeah. know he actually had leprosy. Yeah, that's why they gave him, he got turned all the way Yeah, Because yeah. yeah. the Lord cursed him. That's part of the law, okay? So, uh, he, Wicked. <laughs> yeah, but even though, yeah, so if it says when you all turn white, you're clean. So you're going to have people to have light skin, they're actual Israelites. That, that's part of the curse. That's why you got in Matthew 10, the Lord said, uh, cleanse the lepers, uh, raise the dead. You know what I'm saying? He said cleanse the lepers. You know what I'm saying? I cleansed the... Uh, well, that's Jake. Right, right, right. He, he was kicking... Sorry, what is Jake? When you say Jake? Uh, Jacob. Oh, Jake. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, cool. Jacob. Uh, I'm like, I'm like... Oh, that's he's like, you're Jake. I'm trying to be like, who is That's that Israel <laughs> right there. All right, all right. Cool, cool. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, let me get a scripture. I'm going to give you the curse. Moses, <laughs> Moses wasn't happy with him. Right. He was always cursing him out. Like, man, Israel always been hard-headed and stuff. See, that's a good way to do the spirit when you read the scriptures. You don't just look at skin color. I don't judge nobody by the color of the skin. Right, right. Sometimes it could be an indicator. Because of the oppression, because right. we rock our, our masters, so okay. that's what came into our right. list to, to judge off the skin. Like, hold on, he ain't Israel. So that's why I'm trying to, that's why I'm here, like trying to get yeah, the perspective. Like. That's what I'm saying. Because, uh, look at this, Deuteronomy 30 and 1. And it shall come to pass, this is, uh, this is Moses speaking, talking about the most, talking about what's going to happen. And that shall come to pass when all these things come upon thee, the blessing and the curse, which I have set before thee, and thou shalt call them to mind among all the nations whether the Lord thy God have driven thee. It said among all the nations. Okay, that's why the, when you read it, uh, he said you're gonna bring it back to our mind, speaking about the future. Right. So, so that's why we gotta come out here and bring, bring it back to people's minds. Right. It's like in the book of Matthew, see people try to say Jesus loves everybody. He said preach the gospel to all nations. But what they don't understand is he said preach the gospel to all nations because Israel is scattered among all nations. That's right. what they don't get. Right. You know what I'm saying? It says, and shalt return unto the Lord thy God, and shalt obey his voice according to all that I command thee this day, thou and thy children, in all thine heart and with all thine soul, that then the Lord thy God will turn thy captivity, have compassion upon thee, and will return and gather thee from all the nations, whether the Lord thy God.